Okay. Hi, y'all. It's Teresa. It's um, Tuesday, August 3rd, um, and I'm one week post-op, so yay. Um, feeling much better than I did uh, on my last video, which was one day post-op, which was kind of rough, but anyway, um, I let me give you my stats for now. Um, my starting weight was 288.6. Today, this morning, on the scale, I was 268.1. That's a total loss of um, 20 pound, 20.5 pounds since I started the pre-op diet. Now, 13 of that was bef I lost on the pre-op diet, and so I've lost a little, you know, around six pounds since um, since surgery. So that's good. Um, I feel um, really good. I've been trying to get some exercise in. I've been walking um, a little bit, probably not as much as I should, but I'm I'm having um, still having some problems with the gas pains. It seems like um, the pains are worse uh, in my shoulder and stuff right when I eat, which it's totally freaking me out. It feels like um, somebody's driving a nail right through my shoulder bone here, or whatever this bone is, but. Um, Anyway, so um, I've found that a little um, heat, the heating pad, or you know, put laying down and putting some pressure on it seems to help. So um, I have my f one week follow up doctor's appointment tomorrow. So I'll, I'll of course ask about that. Also, I have um, a support group meeting. Um, my doctor's office does these support group meetings once a month, and it happens to be tonight. So I'm going to go to that um, this afternoon. Um, and um, you know just kind of get my foot in the door or whatever so um, what else is going on I've been journaling everything I've put in my mouth um, I'm having a hard time getting in all the protein that I, I'm supposed to get in I'm still you know obviously on liquids and um, so um, beyond you know protein shakes um, it's it's just hard to get all the liquids and all the all the protein that I'm supposed to get. So um, I really hadn't been um, writing down the you know amounts of protein and everything that I've eaten um, until today. Today is the first day I started that. So it seems like I I'm, I've done pretty well today. Um, I'm I'm being really creative with um, with food. Um, I had some. A can of well, I opened a can of the Progresso Light Chicken and Dumpling Soup or something like that, and I um, measured out eight ounces. I put it in the blender and blended it all up, and then I strained it so it was all very smooth, and put a little, a few seasonings in it, and ate it, and it was really good. Um, so I have the rest of that in the fridge. I'll I'll eat that tonight. But um, so today's probably the first day that I've actually gotten more than sixty grams of protein in. Um, in the day, so maybe, maybe writing it all down is is the trick. Um, let's see. My incision sites are pretty much feeling better. I mean, they're I can barely feel three of them. Two of them are still kind of tender and sore, and, and the the biggest one, I guess, is where the port is. Is there? It's bruised around it. So um, I, I'm. It's tender still, but. For the most part, I'm, I'm feeling really good. Um, let's see. Um, I kind of get tired easily when I'm out walking or whatever. It takes me, like this morning, I walked for about 40 minutes and got home and I was exhausted. Um, probably because I'm not getting enough protein. Hello. Um, but anyway, so um, I get rested up and... and you know, take it kind of easy. I feel like I'm, I'm being kind of a wimp because I really, um, I don't know. I lost my job, so I've, I'm not, I'm not working. So um, I've kind of don't have anything to do around the house and stuff. So um, I've been looking for a job, which is, which is uh, not fun. But anyway, um, let's see what else, what else, what else. Oh. Um, I have a few non-scale victories. Uh, on Saturday, 
was the first time that, other than walking a little bit in the neighborhood, it was the first time I actually got out of the house and went somewhere. Um, my husband and I had an event to go to, um, a fundraiser thing with some people that we know. And um, when I got there, people came up to me and, and said, oh my God, you look great. So that was pretty cool. And um, I got to talk about, um, you know, what I've done and where I am and all that kind of stuff. So a lot of them know um, the situation and know I had surgery and know I'm on this journey, but a lot of them don't. And so they, they were just amazed that, that I look so good already. But also, um, another shout out to Melissa Loses It All. She gave me uh, some of her uh, clothes that she can't wear anymore since size 20s and 22s. And a lot of those, well, first of all, when, I, <laughs> when she gave me them, it was seven big bags full of clothes and it was incredible. It took me two days to go through them all. Because of course I had to try them all on at the, at when, you know, when I took them out of the bag and saw them and stuff. So um, once I got them all sorted through, I I divided winter clothes, um, got put away, and I had got the summer clothes and, and you know I'm enjoying them. But there's an, uh, some of the summer clothes that were too small that I left in a in a bag and and um, so Saturday morning I tried I went in there and I I decided to get them out and try them on and. Almost all of them fit. <laughs> so, uh, I'm still in a 20, 22, um, but I was up, I was wearing some 24s before, you know, a few months ago, so, or a month ago. So, um, that's another non-scale victory for me. Um, I got nothing else, really. I, I've been thinking about... Um, journaling or you know showing you guys what kind of foods and stuff I I'm eating but I'm really not eating anything excuse me right now so um, maybe I'll do that once I once I get to get to my mushy foods and, and stuff like that I've got um, I've got a, a whole list uh, my husband and I are going out of town next week so he uh, suggested that I make copies of what I'm allowed to have on the full liquid diet, which is all this stuff, and I've got the date on there through August 10th, so that's the stuff I can have through August 10th, and then the soft food diet, August 11th through the 25th, so that's all the stuff I can have. So I'm keeping these pages with me at all times when we go out of town so I can reference stuff. Um, anyway, I think that's all I've got for now. Um, I've been watching videos like crazy, and um, I appreciate everybody who's um, who's posted, you know, their journeys from start to well, it's never finished, but start till now. And um, so that's all I got for today. I will see you guys next week. Okay, thanks. Bye.